Gorgeous, it's Adele from Get Gorgeous. How are you today? Low calorie food is full of toxins. If you start increasing low calorie food, you're increasing the toxicity in your body. Why is that so dangerous? Well, it's not just low calorie food, is it? There's so many healthy products out there, manufactured healthy products that make us believe that they're good for us. And that's what I wanna to talk to you about today. And I want to give you five danger signs, warning signs that you've got to look out for, things that you may or may not have considered. Now, to my mind, the diet industry is exactly that, an industry. We, they produce manufactured products with clean typefaces, healthy colours, simple packaging and clever wording to make the whole thing look attractive and clean living and good for us. So the five dangers in this clean looking food, I want you to consider. I've done it, you've probably done it. I've wandered into Waitrose or Sainsbury's on a Saturday morning. The packaging looks amazing. The ingredients look fantastic. There's a rare berry in it that's going to make me feel fantastic. And it's also going to reduce my bottom size in one mouthful. I'm gonna buy it, who wouldn't? Why do we give such credence to marketeers, food manufacturers? Because it fools us into looking so good. And these things can range from smoothies, low-fat yogurts, muesli, bread, healthy looking meals. It's all marketing. It's all had the good for you makeover. <laughs> And what do you need to worry about? Well, firstly, if you're considering drinking a smoothie or something like that, something that's been processed quite a lot, you're reducing one of the essential elements and that is fiber. So if you're pulverizing the fruit, you're reducing the fiber. So it's one less energy pro energy system that your body has to do. Your body doesn't have to digest anything. It doesn't have to produce any energy to eat the product. It goes straight into your system. Well, that's fair enough. You say, I'm getting the vitamins straight away. Oh, but you're not. Because the energy that your body needs, you're not burning anything off because you're taking it straight away. And also, fiber creates a protective layer. It's a barrier in your intestine. And if that fiber is broken down before you consume it, then that layer is also broken down. Secondly, free sugar. That's what the NHS call it. Free sugar can be sugar that's added to a product. So you'll get that a lot in low fat products, but it is also the sugar that already exists. So when you blend fruit, when you pulverize fruit, the natural sugar is instantly released and it becomes a free sugar. It's free not to be happy, it's free to go and cause havoc in your body. Glycation is when sugar ages your body. It's the effect that sugar has. And when you've pulverized fruit, that's what it becomes instantly. The body doesn't break it down. Your glucose and your insulin level go sky high. So high sugar is my third point. So for instance, I was looking at an innocent smoothie, comparing it with a Mars bar. Now, if you're low calorie counting, the innocent smoothie comes off, it was the blueberry and pomegranate one. The innocent smoothie comes up with 171 calories. Bang on, bring it on. A Mars bar is 229 calories. So okay, which one are you gonna go for? But if you break it down even further, the smoothie actually has 34 grams of sugar. 34, that's natural sugar. That's not been added. That is a free sugar to go off and cause chaos. A Mars bar, 30 grams. <laughs> so it's the packaging. It's the idea that we think it's healthy, it must be good for us, but it's not. The other thing I want you to consider is your five a day. 
So when you're having these healthy products, they'll say to you, oh, but it's two of your five a day. Uh, uh, uh. It is not possible to have two of your five a day in one product. It doesn't matter if it has got five different fruits and veg. It is not two of your five a day, it's only one. Now, the, my big beef, this is what I really want to talk to you about, is number five, is toxins. It's the products that are added. Now, okay, there's going to be products that have nothing added, and they're brilliant, but you still have to be aware of the things that are naturally there. But it's the things that are added to products, especially low-calorie products. Now, what is a toxin? A toxin can be a number of things. Anything that you metabolize in your body has debris. And that end product of metabolism is made worse if you are stressed or if your diet is very, very poor. If you're not getting enough veg in your diet, then the end products are going to become more and more toxic. Any infection that you have, and if you have antibiotics to combat that infection, that is a toxin for your body. Parasites, pollutants in the air, insecticides from not washing your fruit, drugs and alcohol are toxins, man, but you knew that. Plastics, drinking out of your plastic water bottle, the BPA, microwaving, <laughs> we all know that. But it's the food additives that are added to products that are also toxins. And these toxins affect your body. There are two types of toxins. There are water soluble and there are fat soluble. Now water soluble toxins are dead easy to get rid of. Hydrate, urinate. <laughs> water soluble toxins will go. Fat soluble toxins have to go through a process in the liver. You produce bile in the liver and bile helps to break down the fat soluble toxins and turn them into water soluble toxins. Isn't your body amazing? Yes. However, if you have a lot of toxins in your body, if you're having a lot of food additives, if you're eating low cal foods, drinks, blah, 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 then your body is overloaded. And not just your body, your liver is overloaded. Your liver can't cope with the amount of toxins that it has to reduce. So do you know what it does? It bypasses it, it doesn't bother to digest it. The bile becomes thick and oozy, it cannot do its job properly. So these fat soluble toxins are running around your body. They are causing damage. When they cause damage, they don't break down, they go back into the blood and they create inflammation. Inflammation I've talked to you about lots and lots of times. Inflammation is the real marker in your body for ill health. It causes your health to decline. It also causes damage to your body and of course inflammation causes damage to your brain. So food additives that are being added to your products that seem quite healthy because they're low cal or whatever are causing quite a destructive pathway in your body. You, it affects your metabolism and damages your mitochondria. Your mitochondria are your little energy blocks, little energy cells in your body. And you're going to become tired if you're trying to get rid of toxins. Your hormone levels, if your toxins are still overloading your body, it affects your hormones. And leptin is the appetite suppressant. Leptin is the hormone that tells you when you're full. Well, that becomes out of kilter when you have toxin overload. Your beta cells also affected by toxins and they help to manage insulin. They've done research, they've done 10 years worth of research to say that high toxin levels are created uh, damaged beta cells which damage the insulin and becomes insulin sensitive you sorry desensitized to insulin so that research is telling us that there is a link between toxins and diabetes too much toxins in your body your body can't cope and it leads to inflammation the toxins in your body cannot circulate too much so your body is incredibly clever 
and it covers, it saturates these toxins and pushes them away from your organs. So it sits underneath your skin. Do you know what the toxins are covered in to keep you from being ill? Fat. It creates a fat casing and hides it as far away as it possibly can away from your organs. You are not going to lose weight if your body is full of toxins. I'm Adele from Get Gorgeous. My book is out soon. You can order it right now, get-gorgeous.com forward slash book, or you can read the blog, find out more. Take care, speak to you soon.